Coast. Marty Schwartz here with Marty Music. We're going to break down Black Crows twice as hard. Got to say, I think this is one of my favorite bands, so uh, it's going to be a lot of fun for me as well. Also, thanks for supporting what I do, Marty Music. Appreciate you subscribing to the channel, clicking the bell notification. Also, I've got links below for you to check out that will help your guitar playing. And I appreciate any and all of that extra support. All right. Let's break it down. All right, the secret sauce for this song is the open G tuning. So that'd be D, and then G, and then D again, and then G again, and then B, normal B, and then high E down to D. Now, I'm not using the low string uh, for any of this. If it gets in there, that's okay. Like, if you just strum the whole guitar, it's the G chord. It's a little fuller when, or I mean, it's just a little tighter when you, uh, I'm using my thumb to just kind of rest and mute that string. All right, so the opening riff is just these two strings, which creates a G power chord. So I'm hitting the two strings. And then I'm sliding while the D string focus on making sure that D string rings out, but if the G rings out with it, that's cool too. So, so I'm going pulling it off and then going up to the fifth fret. Then in a classic Keith Richards mode. So you're just holding that and you add the sixth fret on that B string and the seventh fret on the D string. It would look like if it was in standard tuning, this would look like a D minor 7 chord, but because of the open G, you're adding the um, sus4. And that little boogie right there. Now the other riff, da -da 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 -da, you're hitting the open A and D, open, open. Did I mention it's open? And then I'm going to the third fret and sliding to the second. And I hit it again open, so. So. that verse there's a uh, two guitars but the 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 you know the rocking chord part I'm muting that top string and I'm going and sliding up to that fifth fret but the other guitar it's probably in standard tuning but if you were in open G uh, actually, either standard or normal, you still have this G string, and you're just doing a whole step in, second fret G. So they're, they're doing a call and response. So the only other thing is, you know, uh, the verse. Up to this and stay up to the 
That's the only thing that's being added. So when it goes back to the chorus, it's that slide lick again. So like, dude, I'm not going to try and sing this. Come on. Where's Chris? Chris Robinson, get in here. Yeah. No, you don't want to? Okay, sorry. I'll just play without the vocals. Uh, so yeah, so you go into the chorus. So those are the only parts in the song. You've got, you know, a solo, which I uh, got a solo in standard tuning, but the solo is just the. And then finally. You know, into that. So th that's all you got. And it's just a great rock and tune. Also great. Um, example of that open G tuning that Keith Richards made so successful, but you can do so much with it. For instance, so please enjoy. All right, hope you guys enjoyed the lesson. Thank you again for hanging out. Really appreciate it. You know, feel free to request stuff you'd like to see in the comments below. I do always look at those. And uh, also, you know, if you haven't yet, I really appreciate you subscribing here to the channel Marty Music. And uh, thanks again. Hope to see you later.